Lemonade Stand Foundation. It's going to be holding its annual Lemon Ball fundraiser this Saturday. The foundation funds research for safe and effective treatments for childhood cancer. They also support families who are dealing with cancer and its many side effects. And we want you to meet Tony. He beat cancer but has been battling side effects for years. Yeah, he is quite a warrior and our Stephanie Stahl has his story. One, two, three, straighten up. 16-year-old Tony Salerno needs help standing up. Leg braces give him strength to take a few steps. Yeah. There's a lot of things I have to learn to deal with. After first being diagnosed with neuroblastoma when he was two, Tony has had a series of setbacks. All of the treatments needed to save his life have caused a host of new problems. He just, he just amazes me. Mom Karen feels lucky he survived the last set of complications that started after he had a kidney transplant in 2017, where his dad was the donor. You do what it takes. We have to figure out a way to live each day the best way we can. That was two years ago. Since then, the family was crushed to learn how bad things could get. After the transplant, Tony had multiple organ failure and was given less than a 5% chance of survival. Sometimes you just get so frustrated you want to scream, you know, what else does he have to deal with? After eight months in the hospital, Tony developed critical illness myopathy. All the connections between the brain and muscles disappeared, which is why he has trouble talking and moving. At times, it can be frustrating, but I just have learned to deal with it. There's no reason to be angry about it. I can't help it if I try. But rehab is helping. He's getting his strength back, and last summer even made Eagle Scout. It doesn't stop. Nothing is going to get him down. And like I said, I take my energy from that. She says a lot of support has come from the foundation started by Alex Scott, who lost her battle against neuroblastoma when she was just eight. Alex's Lemonade Stand has been a blessing for us. Um, like Tony had mentioned, it's given us a second family. It's been support, it's been friendship, it's been a shoulder to cry on when we're away from home. They're a amazing foundation that has helped many people, including myself. For now, Tony is cancer-free, enjoying video games, a teenager with wisdom beyond his years. We make do with what time we have. He is quite the warrior. Now, tickets are still available for the Lemon Ball, which will be hosted by our own Jessica and Yuki. For more information and tickets, just go to our website, cbsphilly.com. Mm, 